Hello there, and we're all set to go here at the Pre-Zero Arena in Zinsheim. I'm Derek Ray, and joining me for commentary is Lee Dixon. And we have live action from the Bundesliga coming right up. It's Hoffenheim up against Hertha Berlin. I'm excited, Derek. Really looking forward to this game. Come on, bring it on. Well, every football coach likes to have a versatile forward in his ranks. Andre Kramaric is certainly one such player. Lee, what do you think we might see from him today? Well, yeah, Brace in his last game, he'll certainly be a threat. Can he get another two goals or even three in this game? A look at the initial 11 for Hoffenheim. Looks as though they're going with the belt and braces approach. Yeah, 5-3-2 or 3-5-2. The midfield will be flooded when they've got the ball. Defensively, those fullbacks will be asked to supply support to their three centre backs, but it does enable you to play two strikers up front. A look at the Hertha starting lineup. I'll tell you what, you don't see this formation every day of the week. No, I mean, it looks very attack-minded with the three up front. The three in midfield supplying the width as well, but I'm a little bit worried about the three centre-backs. Will they get exposed in the wide areas? And the match begins. Kader Zabek. On to Samaseku. Baumgartner. Andrei Kramaric. And dispossessed. Luca Bacchio. Can they find a gap in the defence? And with that, the attack fizzles out. Looked as though they meant business, but now they've got to try again. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. Well, they couldn't quite muster a real threat. Andrei Kramaric. Rudy Baumgartner Useful looking position you've got to say Excellent refereeing Advantage in operation The referee spotted the infringement And it will be a free kick in a position of genuine menace Well, I could watch this time and time again, Derek. Starts outside the post, but he gets so much movement on the ball to pull it back in. Just a sublime free kick. Well, let's have another view of that goal. One nil then. Zeefuik. Tussar. It's with Tussar. And here's Cunha. How can he take them on and beat them? Well, that's how to break the spirit of the attacker. 
Baumgartner. Sebastian Rudi. And Kramaric on the ball. Now, do they mean business on this occasion? A bit sloppy in possession. Luca Bacchio. Well, they want that equaliser, but the passing remains. And he's through here. Well, they can say a big thank you to the goalkeeper. That was inspirational. Well, that's as good as a goal at the other end. Brilliant save from the keeper. And short it is. Toussaint. Chance here. And they've done it to square the game once again. Exhilarating. Well, here's the goal again, and it's a great ball to put him through. And when he gets through to the keeper, he just smashes it past him and gives him no chance to think. A lovely finish. Well, the earlier goal cancelled out, one apiece. Sebastian Rudi. Pavel Karajabek on the ball. Diadi Samaseku. Working away patiently, looking for an opening. Bebou. Sebastian Rudi with it. Really good challenge. Cordoba. Matteo Guendouzi. And here's Cunha. Guendouzi. Passing it around, looking for the goal that would put them ahead. And an astute piece of defending. Andrei Kramaric. Samaseku. Bebu. And Kramaric on the ball. Not a huge chunk of added time. One minute. Andrei Kramaric. And so it is, the first half story has been written. Well, a lot to like about Andrei Kramaric based on what he's put into the game so far. Lee, your review of his performance? Well, Derek, he's done what he gets paid for. He's scored a goal, he's put his team in a good position. He's played very, very well as well. He's been lively, imaginative. The two teams have switched around and are ready now for the second half. Luca Bacchio. Zeyfauk. Toussaint. Cordoba. Wenduzi. And good use of advantage. The referee allowing play to continue. And now they have the ball back. Andre Kramaric. Ryan Sessegnon has it. Richards. A fine use of the ball. An alert intervention. Zeyfauk. Ball with Klinter. Cordoba. It's with Toussaint. Giving the ball away. 
Well, let's see if something comes of this. And mistimed the run, sadly. That's offside. Here it is now, a substitution. Luca Bacchio. It's with Tussar. Well, nicely cut out. Kada Zabek. Now with Samaseku. Andre Kramaric. Can he give them the lead? Good defending to prevent the chance. Just can't get it past them. Rudy. Must take the lead here. And they have. You've got to say, it has been coming. We can take another look here. I'm sure the keeper is frustrated with the defending. Just afforded too much time in the box and he's never going to miss that. Well, let's take another look at that goal, shall we? Well, 2 1 it is here. Well, look at that. Herter enjoying the bulk of possession here, but it's just whether they can convert that possession into clear cut chances. You sense they need to pick up the pace a little, start utilizing the wide areas more. The back line's doing a decent job. Hopefully, the forwards can do that as well. Well, terrific pass. My goodness, the importance of getting there was not lost on the keeper. Kada Zabek. Munas Dabur. Diadi Samaseku. Baumgartner. And they need to get tighter. Andrei Kramaric. Well, he did his job defensively. Body in the way again. And he's only gone and made it a hat-trick. Absolutely unplayable today. What a performance. Well, as we see again here, this really is patient, accurate, incisive passing at his best. And then the composer is impressive as he smashes the ball with all he has to beat a forlorn goalkeeper. Brilliant strike. No shortage of goals on this match. 3-1. Ten minutes left for play in this match. Toussaint. Niklas Stark. It's with Toussaint. Ball with Klinter. Niklas Stark. Luca Bacchio. Might be onto something with that ball. No problems for the keeper. Diadi Samaseku. Inside the final two minutes of this contest. Really nice ball. Lorian Grilic. Andrei Kramaric. Oh, he's given it away. Well, they stopped them in their tracks. And there it is, the final whistle. And it's a victory for the home side. They're going to be happy with this result, Lee.
Well, you have to say they did deserve the win. The two-goal margin might flatter them a little, but that won't bother them. It's three points in the bag.